Hello guys, so I'm back again and I'm basically going to be doing what I've done with chest but with shoulders. So basically what you're going to be doing is you're going to be lifting heavy as you can uh, for five reps, well, three to five reps and then you're going to be going into a medium round and then a super light round which will be, for medium, will be about six to eight reps and for light will be eight to ten reps and then you can do a burn off for yeah, ten to fifteen reps. But this is basically a week one of a thousand, which I have been doing for chest, and this will be week one of a thousand, which I'll be doing for shoulders. And this is basically just to prove to you guys, you can get stronger just by slightly lifting heavier every week and having a moderate amount of protein. And yeah, I wanna keep this video short. I don't wanna waste your guys' time. So I'm gonna get straight into it and you're just gonna be seeing the heavy lifts that you need to do to get the mass and to look great. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying these videos and um, you know, sticking with what the advice I'm giving if you're a beginner or even if you're not a beginner, it's a great way to really grow some mass and really get yourself strong. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna go straight into lifting light. I'll actually go straight into it now. So I've got it at 47 kg. I'm just gonna do a few reps just to get blood in the shoulders. And yeah, love the support guys. Make sure you've got a watch because it'll be three minute rest after each round for full recovery. And I'm actually lifting this to get it in position as well, which is uh, quite handy. So always tense your core and breathe when you need to. For me personally, when I do warm ups, I don't really like to um, do too many reps because I'm basically saving myself for the heavy lifts that are going to come into play. So yeah, going straight into my heaviest lift, round one. So I just want to say, you know, you should always hydrate, that's super important. You know, you can use any bottle, you can use a coke, you can use a bowl, you can use anything. Just make sure you have a good litre or two in you an hour before lifting because it really helps you lift more, you know, hydrate the muscles and it just helps all round. Just wanted to put that out there. Okay, so this is round two coming up. It is 59.5 kilos. I might be speaking a bit loud because I've got headphones on, but oh well. Uh, yeah, I've got 10 seconds to go. You know, you've got to hype yourself up because it's once a week. You basically be doing this if you're going to follow this procedure. I'm actually going to do back next week, week one of a thousand of back for mass and shrimp. So, yeah, straight into it. I was shaking like a beach, but that's how you should feel. Ooh. So I've got 20 seconds left. This is basically 56 kilos. I'm gonna be going for roughly eight reps. And yeah, let's get this. As you see there, four to five reps, but some weeks you're stronger than others. As long as you're making PBs on most of your lifts, it's good. So I was expecting 
it to get tough towards the end. That was a bit of a wet down, but you know, I did do a PB on my first lift and I hit my goals on my second lift. So for my third lift, I'm more than happy. So one more lift after this, and uh, yeah, then we'll be getting onto a quick burn off for the delts. See you in a second. Okay, so this is the last lift. You really gotta give it your all, you really gotta push, because you know, every week you wanna be getting better, you know, life is about progression, life is about lifting more. So I want you guys to stick with this and get stronger. So yeah, last lift, I've got 15 seconds, 50 kilos, I'm gonna aim for eight to 10 reps. Um, and yeah, anything over nine would be, a, well, anything over eight would be a record for me, PB. So yeah, I'm gonna get straight into this. another record in the bag PB for me and hopefully for you guys too so yeah that's it for the mass we'll see you in a second for the delt burn off so straight back into it I've had a minute rest and yeah got 7.5 kilos on the floor Woo. with these ones if you've seen my previous videos hardly any rest basically straight into it maybe 5 to 10 second rest so you can do as many as you can your first go, 10 to 15 reps or 10 to 20 or 10 to 30, depending on how much you can do. And then you will be doing like probably five or six reps, depending on your strength and your endurance. So straight into it. Just getting some blood in them shoulders. So yeah, five to 10 second rest. Really don't want to be resting too long on these. Ooh, five seconds. I mean five reps, sorry. Five second rest of it. As you can see, it gets you absolutely, I love this lighting by the way, makes me look great. Okay, straight back in. One more round. I know you feel like quitting, but one more round. Come on, one more round. Let's get these delts looking good. Come on, last five. Two. Great. So you guys should be feeling great from this. Your shoulders should be feeling full off. You can do a little bit more work for the back delts, but this one basically hits all the delts in one go. So it should really be enough, depending on what you're aiming for. Okay, so this is the final part of the video. This will be working your traps. You know, we've done our delts, we've done our mass for the shoulders with the heavy presses, and now straight into super heavy dumbbell workouts. 
to really hit these traps. I'm basically going to superset it. I'm going to basically show you guys it's three rounds, minute rest in between, not that hard. So I'm going to quickly put my glove on and get straight into this and hopefully you guys get straight into this too. Ooh. Let's do this. Minute rest. Water, super important. This is like my third refill. Ooh. Okay, straight back into it. And that's basically it. I'm just gonna do two rounds of that as I superseted it. And as it's super heavy at 25 kilos. And yeah, make sure you guys stay tuned for a lot more. Woo, week one of a thousand guys. And stay strong. Love you.